If the door cracked open on Tuesday, the floodgates opened today in Washington state with hundreds of frontline workers getting their first dose of Pfizer's COVID-19 vaccine. About 60,000 high-risk frontline workers in Washington are getting the shot over the next few days. UW Medicine alone vaccinated about 200 employees today and expects to inoculate 400 tomorrow. And I think that the amount of collaboration and the amount of progress that we've made and the scientific efforts is just phenomenal and it's happened at a pace that we've never seen before. The very first person to get the vaccine in our state is Amy Fry, a COVID ICU nurse at Harborview. And for you personally, what was the, um, the physical reaction like compared to, let's say, an annual flu shot? I will say I tend to actually have a pretty uh, decent reaction to the flu shot. I tend to get a little feverish and um, just exhausted, and this was way less than that. I, I felt a little groggy the day that I received the vaccine, and then... Um, yesterday, the day after my arm was a little bit sore, but that's been the extent of it. I mean, very, very mild uh, side effects. The news that Washington is getting its vaccine allotment slashed by 40 percent next week would be a major setback. But Fry says no matter what, prepare for a long journey back to normal. If people had the expectation that they were going to be vaccinated much sooner, but uh, I just say keep socially distancing, you know, stay safe, stay healthy. And then when it's your turn, just wait your turn and get your vaccine. Steve Bunin, King 5 News.